No. Uh, my multi-billion dollar analysis tool? Mean? Tomato. Welcome, everyone. Today, I'm excited to bring you a thrilling, action-packed ride through the movie Levels, where reality gets blurred, truths get twisted, and one man risks everything for justice. Grab a seat as we dive deep into the story. Scene by scene, we'll uncover the mystery behind a brutal murder, relentless conspiracies, and a love that transcends even death. Let's get into it. The film opens with a quiet, almost haunting scene. Our protagonist, Daniel, stands alone on a dimly lit street waiting for his girlfriend, Sarah. The night is cold and silent, and we sense something dark lurking just beneath the surface. They meet under a flickering street lamp, sharing a tender moment, a calm before the storm. But the peace doesn't last. Suddenly, a black van screeches around the corner. Men in dark suits storm out, and before Daniel can react, Sarah is taken, leaving him screaming helplessly reaching for her. Moments later, we cut to Daniel racing through narrow alleyways, frantically searching for Sarah. His voice breaks as he calls out her name, his footsteps echoing in the silence of the night. The tension builds as he turns a corner, only to find Sarah's lifeless body in a pool of light. The shock hits him like a freight train. He drops to his knees, unable to process what he's seeing. This is the moment everything changes. From here on, nothing in his life, or reality, will be the same. Time seems to stand still, but Daniel makes a vow right there. He will get to the bottom of this, no matter the cost. And so, his journey begins. After Sarah's murder, Daniel becomes obsessed. He spends his days and nights replaying every detail, every memory of her. His apartment is cluttered with clippings, photos, and scribbled notes. He barely eats, barely sleeps, consumed by a singular goal. Finding out why Sarah was killed and who was responsible. And then... He stumbles upon something strange, a message from an unknown number. Meet me if you want answers. Without a second thought, he heads to the address provided, an abandoned warehouse on the outskirts of the city. Inside, he meets a shadowy figure named Max, who seems to know far too much about Sarah's murder. Max leans in close and whispers, There are levels to reality, Daniel. Sarah's death isn't what it seems. Confused and skeptical, Daniel challenges Max, but Max offers him something he can't refuse. The chance to experience reality on a different level. He hands Daniel a small metallic device, something that looks like a cross between a futuristic earpiece and a virtual reality headset. With this you'll see the truth, Daniel. But once you go in, there's no going back. Daniel hesitates, but ultimately his need for answers drives him forward. He puts the device on, and instantly his world shifts. He's thrust into a new dimension where everything seems sharper, hyper-real, like reality itself has been amplified. Here, Daniel begins to explore the levels. Each level offers a different perspective on reality. He finds himself in a slightly altered version of his own world, where people and places feel familiar yet disturbingly different. He notices shadows lurking, figures watching him, and feels an unshakable sense of being hunted. He discovers that on each level, Sarah's life and her death play out in slightly different ways, each scenario leaving him with more questions than answers. Through snippets of conversations and flashbacks, Daniel learns that Sarah was involved in a covert organization that dealt with experimental technology, tech that blurred the lines between what's real and what's simulated. This revelation hits Daniel hard. He remembers Sarah mentioning her top-secret job, laughing it off like it was nothing. But now, it's clear her work was far more dangerous than he ever imagined. Just as Daniel starts to piece things together, he's jolted back to reality, the device forcibly removed from his head. Max is there, warning him that he can't just wander freely through the levels. It's not safe, Daniel. The people who killed Sarah, they're watching. They know you're looking, and they won't let you expose them. Max's words confirm Daniel's worst fear. Whoever is behind Sarah's death has access to unimaginable power, and they won't hesitate to silence him. But Daniel is undeterred. He's already too deep to turn back now. Our protagonist's next step takes him to level three, an even more complex and dangerous layer of reality. Here he's confronted with alternate versions of himself, each one shaped by different choices, different paths. In one instance, he sees a version of himself that chose to ignore Sarah's disappearance, living a hollow, guilt-ridden life. 
In another, he's a hardened fighter, cold and ruthless, who sacrificed everything, including his own humanity, to pursue vengeance. These encounters shake Daniel to the core, forcing him to confront who he really is and what he's willing to do to uncover the truth. But despite the fear and confusion, one thing remains clear. He can't let Sarah's death go unsolved. As he moves deeper into level three, he discovers files containing encrypted data about Sarah's last mission. The files hint at an organization called The Origin, a secretive group that uses advanced technology to manipulate reality itself. Hey, quick reminder to subscribe if you're enjoying the story so far. We're just getting to the good part, and you won't want to miss it. Back to the story. Armed with this new knowledge, Daniel realizes he needs help. He reaches out to Lisa, an old friend and hacker who specializes in digital forensics. Lisa is initially reluctant. She knows how dangerous the origin is, but Daniel's determination is contagious, and she agrees to help him crack the files. Together, they uncover shocking information. The origin has been using a device called the quantum filter to create different versions of reality, altering events in one level to impact others. This means Sarah's death wasn't just a random act. It was orchestrated, calculated, meant to keep something hidden. Lisa warns Daniel that messing with the levels can have disastrous consequences. She pulls up a simulation of what might happen if he continues to interfere. Reality itself could shatter, with unpredictable results. But Daniel's resolve only hardens. He tells Lisa he can't live with himself unless he finds out why Sarah had to die. Determined to get to the truth, Daniel decides to confront the origin directly. He storms their headquarters in a heart-pounding sequence of stealth and quick reflexes. With each step, he gets closer to the truth, navigating corridors filled with traps and guards. Finally, he reaches the inner sanctum, where he meets Dr. Evan, the mastermind behind the Origins operations. Dr. Evan, calm and collected, explains everything in a chilling monologue. Sarah had discovered the Origins' true purpose to control reality itself— reshaping people's lives and memories to serve the organization's goals. She'd tried to escape, but they silenced her to keep their secrets intact. She was a risk, Daniel, and so are you, Dr. Evans says with a smug smile. You're meddling with forces beyond your understanding. Daniel, furious and heartbroken, lunges at Dr. Evan, but security forces intervene, capturing him. Just as it seems all hope is lost, Lisa hacks into the building's security systems, triggering an explosion that allows Daniel to escape. He barely makes it out, scarred but alive. In the final scenes, Daniel reflects on his journey. He's lost so much but gained something even more valuable, a deeper understanding of himself, of the lengths he's willing to go for the people he loves. He stands by Sarah's grave, speaking softly, promising her that he'll keep fighting, that her death won't be in vain. In a final twist, he receives another message from an unknown source. You've only seen the beginning. The levels go deeper than you could ever imagine. And with that, Daniel realizes his journey isn't over. There's still a war to be fought, still layers of reality to uncover. But now, he's ready. For Sarah. For the truth. And that's Levels, a story of love, loss, and the relentless pursuit of truth. I hope you enjoyed this journey through Daniel's world as much as I did. If you haven't already, hit subscribe to stay updated on more movie breakdowns like this one. Thanks for watching.